Hey everyone, today we'll be um, going over the new feature we have in our wood shear wall ASD, um, where we now allow the design of multi-story shear walls. So if we head over to our shear wall design, uh, and we can see that um, we still have all the same designs, but now we allow you to input number of stories. So by default, it's, it's one story, um, but if you want multiple stories, you can add up to three, four stories. And now you can see that we replicate the stories here. Um, for the openings, we will replicate the stories as, uh, as they are. So if we go do that, we can see that this opening will be carried all the way up. Um, and this is for uh, panel ratio. So for example, if um, this left panel isn't engaged, uh, then it's not engaged all the way down. Whereas, so the whole um, right panel here is engaged. Um, and you can see that it is engaged um, from the top floor to the bottom floor. And we're going to carry that load all the way through. And we'll design the cords there as well. So yeah, so now we can do that. And then when you apply loads, you can apply loads to um, any of the four stories separate, any of the stories that are inputted separately. So in here, um, and you can apply more than one load per story. Um, if it's the same type of load, we'll compound it. And if it's a different load, we'll, we'll apply it differently. So for example, let's say I want to add 10 PRF of dead load here you can do that. And then we can also add some seismic load. And so we can see that here we're applying um, 0.7 of 3,000 pounds of seismic load. And we can apply this same load on, uh, on level three. And we can see this, these loads are applied here. You can add as many rows as you wish. And of course, each row can be linked into a, a diaphragm analysis. So you can create multiple diaphragms and link them all into one shear wall. And now you can design multi-story shear wall and clear calcs. Thanks.